Hello everyone, I'm Joshua Clement and today I'm going to talk to you about how to replace the washer between the toilet tank and your bowl on your toilet. What happens is a lot of times these gaskets or washers wear out from getting rocked on back and forth and then it'll end up causing a leak to come either through the bottom of your tank and out your bolts or right across the top. For this job we'll be using a flathead screwdriver and a pair of pliers. First thing we need to do is shut off the water to our toilet tank and go ahead and drain the toilet tank. After that's done, we're going to remove the top of the toilet and down in the bottom of the tank, there's some flathead screws down there. We're going to grab our pair of pliers. On the underside, there's a nut. We're going to grab onto that with our pliers and remove the flathead bolts with our screwdriver. After you get it loose, you can apply a little bit of pressure onto the tank and remove those nuts by hand. Now you can actually remove the supply line to your toilet by hand by loosening at the top where it connects to the tank. And that should give you room to get to your next bolt. Now you need to be careful at this point because these are the mounting bolts. So your toilet tank will actually be loose. You wanna make sure that it doesn't drop because it will crack because it's porcelain. So we'll go ahead and remove the nut on this side. After that's done, we're gonna just pick up on the tank and set it down. And right here is that rubber gasket or washer. What you'll do is you'll just grab a hold of it and peel it off. Now you wanna make sure that when you go to pick up a new one, you take in the old one, that way they can match the old one with the new one because a lot of times they're different shapes and sizes. After you get your new gasket, go ahead and put it back into place, making sure that it's seated all the way around the porcelain on your tank. Then we'll pick up the tank and set it down into place. Now I'm gonna reach my hand down into the tank and hold on to that screw down there and put my washer and my nut on. Now I'll go ahead and tighten it by hand and this will keep the tank from falling off. After that's done, I'll go ahead and put the other bolt in. You wanna make sure that you give it a little bit of pressure so you can tighten that nut up. Now you'll grab onto the side of the tank and press down and tighten up that nut a little bit more then you'll go and do the same thing on the other side. And what you're doing is you're compressing that washer down so that way it has a nice seal all the way around. After you get it hand tight, go ahead, take your pliers and your screwdriver and snug it up a little bit more. You wanna work your way back and forth between the two. That way you don't end up with a crooked tank where one side is gonna wear out a little bit faster you also want to make sure you don't over tighten it because that can actually crack your porcelain. After that's done, we'll go ahead and hook back up our supply line. Then you'll turn on your fill line. Go ahead and carefully put the back of the tank back into place. It's a great idea to go ahead and replace this anytime you have to replace your mounting bolts. And it's a lot easier than going ahead and replacing the whole toilet. Thank you all for watching and good luck with this project.